YouTube, Opinionated Reviewer here. And today I got the iOS 5 widget update for you guys. Yes, a widget update. Now today I have not one, but two widget updates and they're by the same developer. So I said, let me put them in one video. The first one is called Notification Shower and the second one is called Status Google. It's by the same guy, IO Stream who created um, Quick Google. I did a video on that the other day and just let's just jump into these widgets. Now the first one you can see right here is called Notification Shower. It says type your reminder here. And basically what it allows you to do is just put a random reminder. So I'm gonna just go and put homework. And every time I scroll, pull down my notification center, I will see that I have to do my homework. Now you guys are probably saying, Oh, you have reminders now in iOS 5, but yes, reminders is not always showing. <laughs> and probably you might cancel out reminders when it reminds you and then you forget about it. But this is always here. So when you pull down, you'll see, oh man, I got to do my homework. And then you skip over it and you pull down again. Oh man, I got to do my homework. And then you skip on down and you pull down again. And, oh man, I got to do my homework. And so on and so on and so on. <laughs> But yes, that's what it is. It allows you to put a little reminder there so every time you scroll down, pull down your notification center to see your tweets, you'll see that you have to do your homework. Now get to it, soldier! <laughs> now for the second one. The second one is called Status Google. And it's just like Quick Google, but this one is integrated into the notification center so I guess it will be a matter of preference whether you want to use this or whether you want to use quick Google so I will just go and just put in a random something hit return and as you can see it goes in the to Safari and it searches random whatever you put it searches it so I'm gonna just go out again I'm gonna go inside the app and pull down and now I'm gonna just search just put in some random letters and just hit return again and as you can see, this one brings up video, shove G off, whatever that is. <laughs> but yeah, that's basically what they do. They're two simple widgets, yet they're convenient. It's a matter of preference if you want to use them. And I'll have the dev files down in the description below. You guys know to always check the description. I put everything down there. And if you're wondering how I changed my wallpaper, I'll have a video up on that soon showing you guys how to change your, wall, your notification center or wallpaper in iOS 5. So if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button and you'll know exactly when that video come out. With that being said, please rate, comment, subscribe. Have a nice day.